Come on, guys. We're young. We're in Bushwick. This is our first big night out. Please don't make me walk home alone with the Bushwick party killer on the loose. Hey, you know what is funny? There's a killer out there, and no one cares! Like what happened to Shannon? <laughs> That's real funny. I'm not a serial murderer. Trust me, I know a creep when I see one. Do I embarrass you, Stewie? Oh, don't be such a little party oh. killer. <laughs> Jesus. What, are you saying I'm no fun? I want you out before I snap. I've had it with you. You're out of the band. Add this to my book of victims. Very funny. Come on in, kill who you want. <laughs> Just killed the hottest party in Bushwick. <laughs> Did you ever love me? Burn this mother down! You took everything from me, and I will kill you. Just a little old me, Tim. Angelo, look out! We've reached our final destination, Red Eye. We're hoping that these are the exact locations that the murders took place. We're staying where an iconic slasher legend killed his victims. It's like staying at the Amityville house or Lizzie Gordon I house. I got you, babe. Being a legend and all, do you know anything about it? Oh yeah. Growing up, our daddy used to tell us stories every night at bedtime about big old Red Eye. Every town has its legends. Ain't no legend. Are the stories true? That's what we're here to find out. Oh my God! Ryan! Who leaves live traps out here in the middle of nowhere? This is all your fault. You knew the legend was real, didn't you? You guys heard that crazy lady. We came out here at our own risk. And if you get hurt, whatever happens, Joe, it's your own fault. And I hope you know first aid. If you scream, no one's gonna hear you. Ago before I joined the force. It was a slew of killings, stabbings, mutilation, torture, and right beside each body was a Bible open to Romans 12, 19. Mr. Dorian, do you recall the uh, evangelist murders happened in this area about 25 years ago? They ever catch the guy? No, the killing stopped, the case went cold, everybody figured the guy just died or got busted on something else that was rotten away in prison. So you think this is a copycat killer? Jack's missing. He never came home last night. I, I called his job. They said he never showed up. They called him the evangelist. Do you read the Bible a lot, Bill? Every day, Doctor. Well, one of my commandments is dudes don't hit on another dude's wife. What do you mean he is scornful? When a guy goes off the grid for that amount of time, I don't think he just wakes up one morning and thinks to himself, I'm gonna go back to slaughtering people again. It means that I kill the wicked. What is it about this case that has you risking punishment? We all have sins, Jack, and we all must pay for our sins. I don't think my mother being killed by some psycho 30 years ago should concern you. It does concern me. Don't tell me what to do. You are wicked just like the rest of them. Doctor, I don't think I want to see you anymore! Should I answer that? In the ice cream truck? You guys have got to see this guy. He scared Elliot so much he won't go back out to get ice cream anymore. Sounds like a psycho. Guess it'll just be me alone with the scary ice cream man. Do you know where Elliot is? He's not in his room. Elliot! So... You want me to check out Willie the ice cream guy because you have a bad feeling about him. We could go looking for him and it wouldn't be that crazy. What is this? This is where he lives. Who? Willie. You're gonna do this by yourself? 
if I have to. No, no. What's that? I can't see anything. Why are you doing this to yourself? I mean, me and Ben broke into Willie's place. Excuse me? What'd the cops say? They said he disappeared. They said he's long gone and that he'd probably never bother me again. You don't believe that, right? Obviously, you're not looking at me either. No, I look like a crackhead. No, there's in the background. Look. He's here. Who? Who do you think? I'm sorry I had to tie you up. But we don't know each other yet. I haven't seen or heard from my daughter in almost two days, and you think she's just saying hello, Dad? I know who you are, Willie. You're insane. Why are you doing this? Watch it, skank. How about it for the Wolves winning Friday night's game, huh? Yeah. Give me a D. Write this down, guys. This will be on your next quiz. Give me an I. Slut. You stay the fuck away from me, you crazy bitch. Give me a C. I'm a psychology major, and parties are just a perk. Give me a K. Sorority life can be tough. What's that spell? Sometimes I think it might even kill you. You're seriously not talking to this behemoth, are you? Sometimes I wish I could just be like them. You just need a bit of a makeover. <laughs> it's nice to have a friend. Change your hair and change your makeup, but don't change who you are. Girls, this is Agnes. What are you girls doing with Agnes? I think she looks good. She looks hot. We're turning her into a pot. I wanted to give you this. I don't think we should see each other. Psycho! for you. I am giving this relationship everything and you are spitting it back in my face. What did you tell her? <laughs> you don't have to do this. No. I thought you looked like you could use a friend. 